Did 20 E come through? Yeah, he's after this one. Oh. I think they're trying out a hot reel or something out there around Berea. Something was sticking, someone reported. We left a handbrake on one of our engines the one night. We oh didn't, no. We didn't know we left it on so we got all the way to the side of it. We were like, what? Something smells like it's burning. Yeah. <laughs> okay. like, I probably left the handbrake on this entry. We'd probably take it off. <laughs> I had a 63B last night that everyone around it was on the Some going down there, down oh, there and so say, yeah. Yeah, that was yesterday, wasn't it? You can't yeah. use the air on those because there's always a kick around. <laughs> those stone trains in Youngstown were the same way. Yeah, Conway East guys haven't figured that out yet. Which, by the way, if someone leaves handbrakes on on both sides of your train, it's not me or Wheezy because freaking. Yeah, I was on the same side. The conductor I was with, his name is Weezy. He told me that specifically, it's a long train. Like, leave handbrakes on one side yeah. so they have to cross. That, that's what we did on that coal train. Because you can't cross those cars. No, right. I mean, you could, but you're not as close. Well, you told me, he's like, that's a pretty thick move, so I just leave it on one side. Plus, it, um, you don't I have to sleep the fourth over on. So, yeah, I push it. So, I'll put two and then put, like, a sixth car handbrake on. Yeah. <laughs> those handbrakes suck that way. Yeah. For a good amount. Stand there for, like, two minutes. Just make that thing. The locomotives are even worse. The ratchet brakes? Oh yeah. Once in a while there are some like the GIMX ones, those have an actual wheel on them. Yeah, they have an actual platform too. Yeah. Yeah. I'd rather have a ratchet brake on an engine though, because at least then you get the brake on. Because you can give it to power oh, Those those wheels, you don't know. Jeez. Go well, on the engines down there, some of them. Are, are they push button ones? Or not? Some, most of them are like the older ones, but the ones that have those admiral cabs, they have an actual brake. You push a button, and it takes like. That didn't sound too good. Actually, come on. Well, that's another problem we have with our two engines. The one night you freaking, we got to release the handbrakes on it, and then the freaking alarm goes off because it's like the handbrakes aren't properly released. So we had to go back up there, set the brakes, release them again. I know it took. I was still training and. Had a NS like road power, you know, we had to get it. And we couldn't figure out how to get the handbrake off because of a push button. We tried turning the wheel and it wouldn't do anything. Hmm. So my conductor, he started messing around with the computer and it was in some, like 15 minutes later, it was in some energy saver battery mode. Yes, <laughs> Mike. Yeah, I don't Mike. get that. Why does, it, why does it have the brake wheel there if you can't use it? I don't know. Decoration. It's like the automatic handbrakes are nice, but only when it works. Gotcha. If, it, if it doesn't work, I'd rather just use the wheel. And if that thing doesn't show that it's off, you aren't moving. Uh, right. I had a CSX one the one morning. I, I messed with it, put it back on, took it off, took it off, went down below, pulled on the chain. That was a detector for this guy. the computer to acknowledge the brake was on. What is that photo? Like, like got all this. Damn. Well, the Who's speeder was this, Mike? Huh? Who's speeder was that? That's mine. I, you still have it? No, 